Hey guys, today's video is about the top 5 best wireless Android Auto Adapter in 2024. I've compiled a list of possibilities through in-depth research and testing that will satisfy the requirements of various buyer kinds, so whether you're interested in pricing performance or a specific usage, we have you covered. I've provided updated links for the best prices in the description box below. Please like the video, leave a comment, and don't forget to subscribe. Number 5 AC will be wireless Android Auto Adapter If you're prepared to spend a significant amount of money, you can get the Akiwabi 3-in-1 Wireless Android Adapter. The brand markets two features, the ability to use wireless support for Apple CarPlay and support for standalone apps that let you stream content from your phone Let's start with the former. If you have both an Android device and an iPhone, you can switch between Android Auto and Apple CarPlay using the Akiwabi 3-in-1 adapter. Support for Apple CarPlay can also come in handy if you share a vehicle with people who have an iPhone. The YouTube and Netflix apps are built in, so once you connect your phone, you can use it as a hotspot to stream content directly to your car's infotainment system. The only downside is the high price tag, but you're paying for the extra functionality here. Simply put, it's a good alternative to the Motorola Ma 1 adapter with better features. Number 4 Car Link Kit 4.0 Adapter The Car Link Kit 4.0 Adapter is a compact and affordable option that provides a seamless connection between your Android phone and the car's infotainment system. This adapter is simple to install and set up, and it is compatible with most head units and car brands. The CarLink in 40 adapter also allows multi-device connection, allowing you can choose whatever device to connect without having to pair the device again. It also supports software upgrades, which is a nice feature. It normally costs around $100. Number 3 AA Wireless Adapter Setting up the AA Wireless Dongle was about as painful as the Carsify Unfortunately it comes with a long braided cloth 18-inch USB-C to USB a cable which is nice you first connect it via Bluetooth it comes up with a menu name like Audio Android Oc Triple X but after that you need to install an app so you can do the required firmware update a QR code for the app is on the back page of the little manual and there's a link on the company website normally it should take over the dashboard but that didn't happen until I went into the app click device settings and set password to disable thankfully unlike so many other devices of this Ilka software for the AA wireless is at least nice to look at though. The settings remain esoteric after that Android Auto popped right up on the screen and worked fine after a few car restarts and replugging of the device into the smart port which is good because there isn't any apparent tech support available from the company. Number 2 AutoCast U2 Air According to AutoCAD, the U2 Air works with 600 plus car models from 2016 onwards, with the exception of select Sony aftermarket head systems. Its boot time is reported at 18 seconds, and it defaults to 5 GHz Wi-Fi. Unlike some of the other suppliers in this roundup, AutoCast has actual offices in the US, but that doesn't mean the gadget arrives in the mail any faster than the attractive looking by final standards. The U2 Air is simple to set up, it comes with a 12 inch USB cable to USB C cable as well as a USB C to USB C connector. Bluetooth is used by the iPhone to connect. The iPhone, like the Play to Air, takes over the screen and supports numerous phones. You may access the U2 Air settings by entering an IP address into your phone's browser. In my tests, most of these devices required a firmware upgrade, but the U2 error was different, it worked right out of the box, and the manual specifically states that updating is recommended when every function works well. I updated it anyway, and the YouTube Air immediately stopped talking to this dash. I could still access the download's Wi-Fi, but the browser setting page wouldn't let me hard reset, so I had to use an old paper clip stuck in the reset button slot. Number 1 Motorola MA1 Wireless Android Auto Adapter It was a close fight between the first two adapters in this roundup, but the Motorola Ma 1 Wireless Android Auto Vehicle Adapter makes the list as a worthy runner-up to the AutoCast. Elegant, non-intrusive design the dark color blends in well with most automobile interiors, and its small shape makes it simple to slip into the center console. 
The supplied gel mat to assist keep the adapter in place is also a nice addition, even though it's a bit pricey because it allows most automobiles to have wireless charging. Google Auto Gone are the days when you had to plug in your phone every time you got into your car. Place of the car The Motorola Ma 1 connects to your phone the moment you get into the car, making it both safe and efficient. Although it requires more steps than the AutoCasts, it is still a plug-and-play style setup process. The unit boasts the same fast 5G transmission speed, making it equal parts sleek and powerful, though it is compatible with most Android phones. The most recent and biggest tech please remember to give this video a thumbs up if you found it useful and to subscribe to our channel for more tech reviews and advice. Also, if you have any questions or suggestions for products you'd like us to review, please leave a comment below. Thanks so much for watching, be sure to subscribe to our channel to remain updated and see you in the next video.